Don't worry. When all this is over, the future will hold something much better. Halt! What is it? Shh. Press on. Gavin, don't look behind you. I'm gonna to count to three. You're gonna turn around and fire. One. Two.
I'm afraid not, young Gaven. This is Zion Minor. Then why have you chosen to live on this godforsaken place? I did not choose. I was banished to this planet 21 years ago. That's awful. Yes, but unfortunately I found a home safe from the Rithane. Well, thank you for saving us from the Rithane, but now we really must be off. <laughs> why do you laugh, old man? Well, those are not the Rithane. Those are merely the Aquilin. Those are trivial creatures with wee little teeth, nothing to worry about. They seem slightly more than trivial when they attempted to devour us. Compared to the Rithane, the Aquilin are of no consequence. At least you can get rid of the Aquilin. What do you mean by that? <sighs> Why, the Rithane were, were demons that hunted Zion Major a thousand years, a thousand years ago. Before Zion Major's first contact with planet Earth. Finally, a mighty warrior named Alice Dare conquered the Rithane and banished them to the darkness of Zion Minor. That's a fairy tale. How can you be so sure? Well, have you ever seen one of these demons? No, I have not. But I know they are real! I believe you. Come on, Gaben. We've no use for this paltry hermit. Gaben. Are you not coming? This man was kind enough to offer a shelter. Gavin, the man is crazy. He's been marooned on this planet for over 20 years and has gone mad! You may say whatever you want about me. Forgive me. However, I shall not decline my offer of shelter. If you see any of the Rithane, feel free to return to me! I heard you did not even give that man a chance! The man did not deserve a chance, Gavin. We must fend for ourselves we're going to be stuck in this planet for any length of time. He could have helped us! He was marooned on this planet, left to die! The only man who can help us is one who has access to a spacecraft of some kind. Come on, Gabe. Buck up. We must find a safer place than this to make camp for the night. Why do we need to find a safer place if there's no such thing as a Rithane? I don't want to be out in the open when an Aquil comes and attacks us in the middle of the night. Sir, do you require anything to eat? No. 
My name is Gavin. I'm here to request that you aid me in my pursuit in the ultimate subjugation of the Rithane. If you're refusing to assist me in my quest, then I ask permission to leave this place and search out other survivors who will help. Wait! We can help you. How? Basically, 20 years ago, our fathers had the same notion as you, to go out and try to kill the Rithane. They were mostly successful. But how did they kill them? With a spear. A spear? Well, have you any spears? I see. Well, thank you for your advice. I shall certainly take it into consideration. I beg you, don't go! If that is all the help you can offer, I'm afraid I must. I'm looking for soldiers, people to help me fight. You must understand our hesitation. I told you about our fathers. They're the ones from whom I need help. They all died in the process! I do not wish to be the cause of anyone else's death. But I will not stop until my vengeance is sated. I thank you for the advice on the use of a spear, but I'm afraid I really must be going. Wait. My sister has withheld information. She lies when she says we don't have any spears. You do have them? Yes. We are also certain of their use, and have spent years practicing the craft of their warfare. Then you're exactly the men I need. And I'll end my search here. Gavin! <laughs> this should be a pretty good place to make camp for the night. <sighs> Gavin! What? I'm coming back out. Do not enter the cave! You must let me go. I cannot and I will not. Gavin, go to the old man. You caught him senseless. He will take care of you. I need you to take care of me. Gavin. Be bold. The enemy. What enemy? Defeat the enemy. <laughs> Our family were pilgrims from Zion Major. We thought that the Rithane were just a myth, but we soon found that we were wrong. I was actually born here on Zion Minor. The only human to boast such a claim. <laughs> if such a claim merits boasting. Of course it does. You are the first of a generation yielded in freedom. Yielded, but never fulfilled. Not yet, anyway. The Rithane stand in the way of our freedom. You really think the dream of our fathers can still be fulfilled? I see no other option. Thank you. Hermit. I need your help to avenge your Rithane.
Will you please assist me in this task? If you will not assist me, I will do this alone. Silly boy, you cannot do this alone. I know that I cannot, but I will not stop until I vanquish the Rithane. This is the one he used? That's the one. What do the carvings mean? They're symbols from ancient times. None of us knows what they mean. Well, let's not practice with this one. Not bad. Not bad at all, but surely the Rithane aren't going to be standing still, just waiting for us to throw spears at them. Gavin. You'll know what you know what it feels like once you've experienced love. You know what it feels like to lose that love. And you'll know what you want to do to whoever makes you lose. I propose we head out tomorrow. That's too soon. A week at least. <laughs> but it'll be winter before too long. <sighs> Let's let Gavin decide. Well, perhaps we should wait until winter's over. <sighs> but that's months from now. The longer we wait, the more practice we get. He's right. <sighs> but we've been practicing for years, and, and Gavin seems like a natural. Gavin's word goes. But... Gavin's word goes. Uh -huh. We will begin our search when spring comes, though. Perhaps we should wait until spring to make our decision. I just wanted you to know that I'm proud of you. Hey, fuck up, Gavin. You and I both know that this is the right decision. We're safe here. How do you know? There hasn't even been an Aqual attack in years. Yes. Yes, I suppose you're right. Well, it's supposed to be a communication device. Supposed to be? 
can see it's broken. I believe Raya dropped it on a rock. Are you usually good at fixing that kind of thing? Oh well, yes, but not since Raya got a hold of it. What would you say if I said that I knew how to get us off this planet? I'd say that's great, but how on Zion do you plan on doing that? Do you realize your brother has an aptitude for fixing things? Wolf guy? Yeah, he's always taking things apart and putting them back together. He's responsible for that contraption in your mouth. Well, I happen to know of a ship that crash landed not too far from here. I'm not sure how far these work. Astro and I tried them out, and they don't seem to work for more than... I'd say a few, a few miles. Well, at least this way I'll be able to tell you when I'm on my way back. Incidentally, when do you think that will be? Let me put it this way. If I'm not back in a month, don't bother waiting up for me. When are you leaving? Tomorrow. How long? I don't know. I'm going to miss you. This is for us, Rhea. For the future. So we can be together. I know, but you just got here. Now you're leaving. Rhea.
back up, back, back up. How long do we have? Still have a couple hours. Are you sure the ship's going to come? I've worked with these guys before. It'll come. You realize this is the end, right? We've been on this planet, suppressed by tyranny and oppression all our lives. Now we're escaping to freedom. Who are you? Why have you taken me captive? Why won't you answer me? When all this is over, the future will hold something much better. I thought I told you to keep a lookout for her. I'm sorry, I just wanted to listen today. When will you two give up? Never. He told us to stop waiting after a month. It's been three- I'm not gonna give up on him. It just hurts. It hurts to think about him. I'm sorry, Rhea. Sorry. It's okay. I'm sorry you feel that way, Rhea. I'm not gonna give up on our friend. I know he's still alive somewhere. He's... He's gonna come back. And we're gonna get out of here. I did not allow it then, and I will not allow it now. He killed my son! I want only vengeance for this evil. Has he not suffered enough? Let him be an asset to you rather than a constant burden. He doesn't deserve to live in any form. That is against Rithane Code. Since when are you the resident expert on our code? Since you lost your reason. Fine. If we are to fix him, let us do so now! So don't you know I must be the one to do it?
not to listen to that anymore. Gavin? Gavin! mean they're coming. Who do you think he meant? Surely he meant... Look, it's not like we haven't been preparing for this. We've made the spears. We've been practicing for but years. But do you really think we can do we this? We don't have a choice!
You are one of us. <laughs> Lucky five in this. We fix her, we solve all our problems. Don't touch her! Why not? We will not be turned. Ledger, how could you do this? Gavin, for the first time in my life, I'm free, truly free. If you two become one of the Rithane, together we could rule this planet. But the Rithane are evil! Mankind is evil! Gavin, don't you see? Mankind is a weak race that cannot survive without killing itself. Mankind destroyed both of our lives, Gavin, don't you see? But no more. No more! Become a Rhythan. Experience life as it should be, not as men live it. Ledger, I fought for you. Those men died for you! All man does is fight and die. Rhythane, live! But you are the last survivor. Because of mankind! Because they cannot understand anything different from themselves, so they killed us off! Well, we can rebuild it. With her. Don't touch her! Rayo, run! Even, what are you doing? Defeating the enemy. Prevail, Gaben. I completely agree with you. I can't kill you. You're my brother. No brother of mine. <laughs> Something to clean that up. Some water and bandages, and you'll be fine. Rhea? It'll hurt a little bit at first, but you're tough. You can handle it. Rhea? And then we'll get to the ship, and everything will be fine. Rhea. It's been done. I know, but... There's nothing you can do. <sighs> Just promise me you won't give up. Not after all this. I promise. Rhea... The ship is two and a half weeks to the east. Gavin. Rhea, there's nothing left for you here. The ship is not just the only hope left for you, but for all of mankind. 